Welcome back to the course and let's continue with setting up the Oracle Apex workspace and before that I just want to tell we were telling about the when you're opening the Oracle Apex from the cloud for the first time you'll be prompted to the administration service where we'll be providing this password and you can just set up the workspace you want and this will be the first setup and once you have set up that you can click on the workspace sign in where you can request a workspace and define the user so i have done it already and let me just sign up to the workspace and let me fill up this so here you can see this is the workspace here and the basic thing which you can see from Oracle Apex side and nothing much special you can just go to the uh, application setup and you can just define whatever you want and what are the objects present here we have some sample tables like the department and EMP and if you want to install some sample objects we can use that as well from the utilities and going to sample data sets if you want to install like a customer orders or if you want a project data you can install those and with respect to language you can install lots of options are there so for our demo purposes we can just you know start with the installing the countries population and the capital that will be very fine too for a basic application so let me install this here and defining the schema and everything only one option will be available because there is only one for now so let me install this and these are the database objects and let me install it so if you want you can create an application but we don't want we are just focusing on the rest services we just want to create apis and let's exit this and if you want to see the objects you can check here you can see that these objects are installed so you can just you make use of these objects and see all the contents here what are the columns as you know already that's been part of this apex in the basic side and you can just explore and we'll just start with uh, setting up the apis in the option where you can see from this restful services they'll start from here in the next lecture